Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here, and welcome to another video. Ladies and gentlemen, today we have the new Chalanoglu to check out. If you are looking into buying cheap and safe FIFA coins, look no further than footcoinshop.net. They have the fastest service, an incredible loyalty reward system, and the best prices around. Use my creator code Inception when you sign up for your account and get a 5% discount with your order. Uh, this is one of the objective cards you can unlock with some Serie A players in your team. Uh, this card is 5 foot 10, high, high work rates, right footed, 4 star skills, lay 5 star weak foot. In game player traits, he's got flare, outside foot shot, long passer, long shot taker. In game attributes, this card is formatted uh, to be a pretty decent card on a lot of different chemistry styles, right? So you can actually give him uh, an anchor, a basic, uh, you know, it's really going to depend on you. You know, if you feel like you want the extra p bit of pace in the card, uh, a shadow could also make a lot of sense for him because a shadow chemistry style would be boosting his sprint speed to be at an 80 or not 80, excuse me, at a 99 with 99 uh, acceleration while boosting his defensive stats to be in a very high area. But look at what the basic does in the card. The basic actually makes him a very well-rounded player, right? They give him a little bit of a pace boost in their necessary area, you know, a little bit of shooting, the dribbling boost as well. So a couple of interesting boosts here and there to make the card uh, very interesting to use. Uh, player traits in game, he has flare, long passer, long shot taker, outside foot shot, in-game attributes. His shot power is at a 97 by default, so those consistent outside foot shots might not be super ideal with the card, but regardless very interesting you know he's a five foot ten player with an average body type so we'll be testing that out in the defensive positions uh he does have a five star weak foot with the improved version of his card with four star skill moves as well right so definitely looks like an interesting card it's actually perfect for us to try out this card because of the 433 formation that we recently reviewed where we're just using like balance instructions so we'll be trying him out in that formation we'll see how he plays hopefully he's a beast Well done. Well done. Good goal. And his ability has been excellent. Hopefully the fans will see more of that over the next couple of years. Can he do it? Oh, that was such a good build-up play. I would have rewarded a goal there. Oh my goodness, the pass was so good too. That's one way to score. <laughs> All right. Oh, I should have just shifted, him, man. I thought a shot would be perfectly fine. This is a great lob, though. Oh, nothing? Unlucky. What? What just happened there? I don't even know. Yo, Chalanaglu has amazing passing. Like, that, it, he's really, really good at passing the ball. Man, I couldn't get the, the green on it. That actually registered to Raheem Sterling, that would have been amazing. Working really well as a team to regain possession. And intercepts again. Oh! oh he's through here. Do I get the chip? I do get the chip. I like it. How do you see it panning out, Stuart? Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality. Nicely done. People who play this game are such rats, you know, because this guy, I've matched him already before and he's quit at 0-0. Zero, zero. 
from me doing the Sterling SBC. And now that I scored the goal in the right in the beginning, he didn't leave the game. Ha. <laughs> Oh, nice try on a long shot. Well done, Chilinog Chilinoglu. Good stuff, good stuff. Oh, that worked out. That worked out. Good goal. No! That worked out. Nice finish. Good build up play. See what I'm saying about the passes? Come off nice, man. Oh, I tried to time it there, but I couldn't. I should have done, done the initial one. Oh, he hits nice finesse shots. That was a great finesse shot. Wow. Very direct on that one. Beautiful finish. Good stuff. Oh, I put too much power on that, man. I'm gonna try to get the green times, you know? Oh, not bad, not bad. Yep, good finish again. Good stuff. I couldn't tell you what happened there with Sterling, but my boy Chalon. And we scored from it. Nice. Good stuff. Nicely done. Man, unlucky. Oh, almost got it there with Chalon. Well done, well done. On side, yeah. Oh, unlucky. Ooh, almost, almost. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. Oh, I wanted to try it. I'm gonna try to free kick like that in a minute. Oh, pressure worked out enough there. 
The ground switch upwards. There we go. Nice, AI gets to that. Oh, at least it worked out a little bit there. Nice. Yeah, it worked out a bit there. It was a little bit weird, but it worked out. Chalanog was actually been pretty solid in the midfield so far. Uh, should be mine, man. That's so dumb. I say I guess that. Thank goodness. Good pass. Showing good defensive judgment. Defensive play. Firmino, chance to put them in front. And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. Clean challenge. Nice. AI hey, gets that again. Good build up play, good stuff. Telenago well, again on the defense. Nicely weighted pass again. And maybe if I hit a green, man. The thing is that that finesse shot's like too close to the middle, you know what I mean? Into the second half, can the Kings bounce back after what happened to them in the first 45? No, oh, he should he should have got the initial one, but it's kickoff, so you know. Pass. Oh, that goes through my legs. Yeah, he has the right animation. I just gotta hit the greens on them. He hits them nicely, though, then. Beauty. Beauty, beauty, beauty. Great strike. Like that quick. Nice. Oh, I had the extra angle there too. It's a lucky. You see? I'm not even hitting the greens on him, he's just hitting them, bro. He has the right animation consistently, too. He's the one that first, he's the first one to get to that, eh? Oh my goodness. How he saved that initially was kind of crazy, man. On 
Nice AI again, man. Close. Beauty of a pass. Ah. Oh. His AI again. His AI is really good. Actually, really solid. Oh, what do I have to do? Shoot across there? Come on, man. I think I fouled him elsewhere, yeah. I was elsewhere. The Shalanago did nothing wrong there. Yep, good build up play. Good build up. That works. Look, that was him again, guys. AI wise, eh? Can he get one back? Oh, no. I guess a double chat, a double shot challenge there, huh? huh. Moving forward effectively. Superb block. Oh, he's given the ball away. AI again. Just 10 minutes to go. That animation, man. Oh, wow. It's so annoying. Okay, guys. So final verdict on the new Chalanoglu card. So, guys, to be honest with you, this is actually a pretty cool gameplay objective. Um... A lot of the times they don't really give you cards that are like that decent to use in the meta of the gameplay, but this card is actually pretty decent. Now, for me personally, I didn't necessarily mind him on the basic chemistry style. Now, I will say that there were situations where giving him a shadow would definitely be a very ideal situation because this is an R-Trigger Merchant game, right? So with the pace being super relevant in this game, uh, it feels very relevant to boost his pace and his defense to be as high as possible because You'd be working with certain variables uh, when it comes to other stats. Now, like I said, on the basic, the card didn't feel that bad either, but it wouldn't necessarily be a horrible choice to provide him with the anchor chemistry style either because of the certain boost that you give the card. So as a gameplay objective, a couple things that I noticed is that as a high, high work rate card, he was actually really nice. Defensive AI uh, definitely helped out on many occasions. I, I didn't really uh, find that to be an issue whatsoever. It was actually really nice for him. 100%. Uh, his finesse shots are really good, which is a very huge variable to work with because he doesn't have the finesse shot trait, but he does have the five star weak foot while working with the fact that he can hit finesse shots. So if I play a card like this over on that left hand side, it's perfectly fine because he plays there really nicely. Like if you get into those uh, edge of the 18 yard box situations, the really like the far bottom or top bo uh, top side his finesse shots actually do come off really nicely. So try that out. Use him on the left side and then go for finesse shots. He's actually very, very solid at hitting them. But uh, yeah, as a gameplay objective, definitely a W card for sure. I enjoyed using it for what it was. It was uh, a really nice card. Definitely going to be added into the uh, A tier category once we do that tier list. If we get to that point because of all these cards we got to unlock, right? But um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy this video today. I'll catch you guys for the next one. Should be Sterling up in a bit. So peace out, dudes. Love you guys.